Well, I'm doing something a little bit different. I am attempting to make my own little DIY studio so I can take my own portraits. And all I have is my room and, uh -oh. and my blanket. And we'll see how this goes. So this is what my room looks like with everything set up. And this is kind of interesting to say the least. This is not at all appealing. If you were to walk in here, you'd be like, what, what, what bro, what are you doing? Let me go through what I did one by one. All I did was hang a bed sheet on the wall. I mean, it's blue, but if I were to adjust the camera settings like I am now, it looks, it's fairly dark. So next up, I have these two lights over here and their job is to make sure that I look like I'm three-dimensional because photography is a two-dimensional di two image. Okay, so what I meant to say here is whenever you take photos, they are 2D. There are no physical shapes popping out because it's a 2D canvas. So we portray a 3D look by playing around with light and shadows. In this case, having both lights create a rim light around my body helps portray that 3D look. And it also separates me from the background so that I don't look like a flat shape. I just wanted to clear that up. Without, wait, without it, with it makes a huge difference. And over here is my main source of light, which is the key light. And basically what it does is it, it lights up the front side of my face and gives me a little bit of, you know, front light to make sure I'm actually being seen by the camera. You can kind of see what the key light does if I were to put my hand over the light and then remove it. So, so I have set this up by having a diffusion panel on top of a of this little light bulb removal extender stick. I have no idea what it's called. I have two light bulbs on a tripod with clamps attached to it so it'll actually stay shining through the diffusion panel. And when I sit down in the chair, this gives me a nice little soft light source. And on top of that, this is, the camera is just set up right there. Let's put you back real quick. Okay. But yeah, these are a couple of the images that I like the most. And if you ask me, they look decent. But which photo do you guys think looks better? Don't forget to let me know in the poll right here. But I really love doing these little lighting tests slash photo video challenges. So if you want to see more of these lighting setups, be sure to let me know in the comments. But with all that being said, thank you all so much for watching. I will see you all in the next video. Don't forget to have yourselves a blessed day and it is time to cover the camera. Doosh.